So let's talk about how you would use it to post an article. All right, so we're going to go to the latest insurance news section. And I mean, honestly, ordinarily what you would do is you would flip through the different tabs to try and find uh, some information that suits you, uh, that you really think would engage your audience. Uh, I'm going to say, uh, let's go with tips on preventing auto insurance fraud. Okay, so we go out to this website, we say, oh, is this a good article? Oh. Oh gosh, it's, it's fantastic. All right, so I go up to the top and I highlight the URL, right click and choose copy. And then I go out to my, my fake insurance agency uh, Facebook page here. I go to this status box where I'm gonna uh, do another right click, put in a paste and boom, right there. Facebook is smart enough that it goes ahead and it just puts in uh, a link right to that page. I can change the little picture that shows. Uh, usually what I like to do is get rid of the actual link uh, that shows up there. And I'll take it out and I'll just type over my own thing there. Um, what do you think? I don't know, make it engaging. Uh, you can also change the title if you want to. Um, sometimes it might be a little too long or it doesn't make sense. If you want to do something that will be a little more interesting to your audience, you can do that. Uh, it's also the same is true for the, uh, the little description there. So uh, after I'm done, I'm going to hit the post button and boom, it's done. So what does this look like to the front end? Uh, let me show you because personally on this account, I went ahead and I like this page. So this is what people are going to see. They're going to see uh, you know, the name of your agency with